Hey Hoopers, Indigo Flow Arts here coming at you with another quick video. This is going to be part two on how to measure your hula hoops. So in part one, I covered how to measure your tubing thickness. And in this video, I'm going to cover inner diameter versus outer diameter. Now, it's a very subtle difference, but it makes a huge difference when it comes to how the hoop feels in your body and in your flow. So let's go ahead and get started. So there's two ways to measure the diameter of a hoop. Either the inner diameter or the outer diameter. Inner diameter is from inner corner to inner corner, and you do want to make sure those are opposing corners. And then the second is from outer corner to outer corner. Now why is this so important? A lot of times when you buy hoops, you might see on the website ID or OD. And sometimes you don't see anything at all. If inner or outer diameter isn't listed within the product description, you need to scour the website until you find where it says how the hoop shop measures its hoops. If you can't find it, then email them. You need to know this before you buy your hoop. The last thing you want is to think you need a 25 inch hoop, inner diameter, and instead you order an outer diameter so it comes way too big. You especially want to be careful with this when it comes to LED hula hoops. In general, all hula hoops are sized a little bit differently. So two 26 inch inner diameter hoops from different hoop makers might still be slightly different sizes. So remeasure your hoops to see whether they're inner diameter or outer diameter, pick which one works best for you, and then pick your next hoop size based on that. Another reason this is so important is because hoop shops may not give you a refund if you unknowingly pick the wrong size because it states on their website that they measure either inner diameter or outer diameter. All right, guys, that's all for tonight. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.